This weather briefing was recorded from the National Weather Service in Blacksburg at about 9 a.m. on Thursday morning, June 16th. Well, there is a risk of severe weather for the entire National Weather Service Blacksburg forecast area today. Most of the region is under a slight risk, but notice there is an enhanced risk of severe weather in the northeastern part of our forecast area from Hot Springs down through Lexington and areas north of Lynchburg. Just as a reminder, an enhanced risk of severe weather means numerous severe storms are possible with a few tornadoes and several reports of wind damage, whereas the slight risk means scattered severe thunderstorms possible. Let's look at the threat for tornadoes today. The best chance for tornadoes, again, is in that enhanced region north and east of our area. Again, looking at um, those areas north of Lexington to, to Lynchburg. But we can't rule out the risk of an isolated tornado elsewhere across the region. The big concern today is with straight line winds, with a line of thunderstorms we expect to move into the area during the evening uh, into the mid-evening hours. And as you can see, the greatest uh, probability for damaging winds is that northeastern part of the forecast area. But we cannot rule out uh, damaging winds on a more localized scale with scattered thunderstorms that develop uh, farther south and west into our forecast area. So I'm going to present two possible solutions uh, that could occur today. The first is a worst case scenario. Worst case scenario has a long line of severe thunderstorms developing in West Virginia and diving south through the heart of the National Weather Service Blacksburg forecast area impacting much of the region. And again, this would be uh, damaging straight line winds and maybe an isolated tornado with this line of storms. However, most of the models are now trending toward this solution, which has the more concentrated line of storms and the greatest potential for a more widespread damaging winds more in Northeast Virginia. But notice that we have more scattered uh, thunderstorms across our area, again, during the uh, evening to mid-evening hours, say between 5 p.m. and midnight, is when we need to be most aware of what's happening weather-wise. So even these isolated to widely scattered to scattered storms that develop south of the line will have the potential of producing locally damaging winds and perhaps even an isolated tornado. So even if the uh, line moves to the north and east of our area, we cannot let our guard down with these uh, scattered thunderstorms that still could produce um, localized damage. In terms of precipitation today, most of the uh, heaviest rain is expected to fall east of our area. These will be fast-moving storms, so I do not anticipate any flooding concerns today. So to summarize, we are expecting uh, thunderstorms to develop between 5 p.m. and midnight, moving from north to south. Uh, the primary hazard will be damaging straight line winds greater than 60 miles an hour and isolated tornadoes, especially again north of that Lexington to Lynchburg line. And these storms will have a lot of lightning with them. So please, when thunder roars, move indoors. The impacts from this line of storms will be trees and power lines down and even some isolated structural damage, which uh, will lead to power outages with those uh, power lines uh, down. So our confidence is moderate for the threat of damaging winds today. It's just how widespread will they be? Will they be uh, more widespread with the uh, line of storms as opposed to isolated with the uh, scattered thunderstorms, which is uh, the scenario that is the, the more likely scenario to unfold. But the key thing is to, to make sure you have a means to receive weather warnings. Identify now where you, are where you are going to go when those warnings are issued. For more information, please uh, monitor our website and our social media pages listed here. We ask that you uh, call us or email us with any reports of storm damage when it is safe to do so. Thank you very much for your time.